Hey, back again. Now, it's been about two hours and I'm starting to cook my meatballs. So I've already done a batch. All I've got is just a little bit of olive oil in there. You don't want to have too much because when you cook them, there was a fair amount of fat that was in the meat. And a lot of that fat's going to leach out when you cook them. So just have it a little bit in there. Now, just put these in. Now, give them a bit of a turn. Now, with cooking meatballs, it's similar to when you cook sausages. You're better off having them at a lower temperature and just cooking from cooking them for a little bit longer. You don't want any raw bits inside and you don't want them to burn on the outside either. So you don't want black on the outside and raw on the inside. So I've just got these on a medium heat. And a fork best to use for small meatballs. And just um, let them cook. Move them around a bit. And they'll become quite firm to the touch when they're cooked. Now I'll just move these aside for a sec while they cook. And these are the ones I've done. Now, if you can put them on some paper towel to absorb some of the fat, that's a good idea, but I haven't got any. Alright, now I've got those there. Now, you might find when you cook them, like I did with these, that they're missing something or lacking something. I didn't have enough salt, the anchovies. I could have probably put some more anchovies in or a little bit of salt. So what I'll do, when I'm, as I cook the batches, I'm just going to put a little bit of salt on top. Just like so. Give them a little roll. And they should be right. And there you go. Easy. Now, what you can do when you're cooking them, once you've cooked a batch, like say you've cooked, um, say, 12, take them out of the pan, put some tomato sauce into the saucepan or any sauce you like, and then just add them back in and just warm up the sauce and stir it through. And you've got a nice sauce. I particularly like that myself. With, if you get a long uh, French stick or bread roll, cut it in half, and then just have the meatballs and the tomato sauce in there, and some cheese. It's um, yeah, very fattening, but it's really nice. What I'm going to have today with these, because it's lamb, I'm just cooking this batch for now, and I'm I'm going to cook, go through cooking them all because everyone's going to rock up soon. Is um, tzatziki, just the um, yogurt, cucumber, etc., and garlic, nice Greek dip. Um, so let's try one, hey? Still a bit hot. I shouldn't really dip into this, but oh well. Mmm. Mmm. Really nice. Needed a bit more salt, but really nice. The other thing you can do too, when you're going to salt them, like I've put some salt on these because I didn't add enough, is if you've got some dried herbs like sage or rosemary, would be nice with these. Just in your mortar and pestle, just grind it up into the salt, and it's just a little bit of extra flavouring when you do it too. So there you go, easy meatballs. Any questions, just give me a yell. Um, I might go through another one. I found, I had the mint in two packets, I didn't realise I found another pack in the freezer, which I've taken out to thaw out. So I might actually make like a meatloaf, or there's a couple of variants on meatballs. You can put anything you like in them really, um, anything from parmesan to basil, to sage, thyme, rosemary, anything you like. They're, if you like lamb or meat or what have you, you can add any, any flavouring that you like to them. So feel free to experiment. Um, now I was vegetarian for years and years and years, so I, I always try and come up with some kind of vegetarian alternative when I do a recipe. But it's a bit hard with this, there's no real alternative is there. So, But these are really nice. Any questions? Just give me a yell. Otherwise, I'll see you soon. So just don't forget, when you cook them, low heat and just stir them around occasionally. Don't fry them too hard. When they're cooked through, they'll be quite firm to the touch. They won't be soft anymore. You can turn up the heat then just to give them a bit more colour on the outside. Alright, easy. Any queries, just give me a yellow up. See ya.